Here we are with Vamoosh book one, number 20, Footprints in the Snow. Let's take a look. I see we have four quarter notes per measure. So we're going to count one, two, three, four in each measure. Okay, we have four quarter notes in each measure. Sometimes that will be a single quarter note. Sometimes it will be a half note worth two beats like that. Down here I see a whole note that takes up the whole measure. This is a whole rest, so it's a whole measure of silence. Right here we have one, two, three, four. Another whole note down here. One, two, three, four. I also see some pizzicato at the end, right? So that pizzicato would count one, two, rest, three pizzicato, four, rest, one pizzicato still, two, three, four, and we're done. All right, so that is the counting. Let's make some room here and let's talk about what notes we're gonna play. I see a bunch of notes, so let's do a little explanation down here. On the bottom, here's my treble clef wrapping around that G. And let's find our D. So we know that if there's a note right there, it is D. If I were to move that note up to the next line there, because they always move from space to line, then I've got the note E, right? And that is one on the D string. If this is open D, that is one on D. One more note up brings me to F sharp. I'm gonna use a sharp for this one because I see all these F sharps right here, that sharp sign. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna use F sharp. And that would be two on D. Right, and we're moving up. We're going from this space right here right, to the next line, up one more to the space, and you've guessed it, the next one is on a line, and that is G. G, not open G, but three on D. You can see our pattern here. And we are going from D to E to F sharp, to G. Now if I go one more, I'm going to get into this second space and we know what that space is right there. That space right there is our open A. Right? So we have open A. Okay, so let's take a look. Our first note is on this line right here. There it is, right down here. It is on G's line. Let's make a little room for ourselves here. Let's just kind of get rid of this for now. Okay, so we have G, which is three on the D string. And I see four of those. Our next note here is one step down. It's in that space, right here it is down here. So it is F sharp, one note down, two on D. One more note down brings us to E. There's only two of those and then I see a D. Now remember, this D lasts for two beats. You have to use a slow bow for that. Then we are back to our E, E, and D. 
D again, and this D lasts for beats three and four. All right, so let's take a look at that first line. Let's say the notes together. Here we go. One, two, three, four. G, 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 G. F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp. E, E, D, E, E, D. Let's take a look at the next line. We have our open A in that second space. That is our A. One note up from that is B. I hope I've changed my pattern here. Well, you guys can keep up, I'm sure. So we have B, there's two Bs, and then I'm back to my open A. B, B, A, A. And here's my open D again. And remember, this one is one, two, three, four. So we've got a nice long note there. And then four beats of silence. So let's say the notes for that second line. Here we go. One, two, Ready, say, A, 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 B, B, A, A, D, rest, 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 rest. Okay, make sure you can play those two lines before you go on. We're going to go on right now though, just for the sake of getting the whole thing into this video. Let's take a look at this third line. Does this look familiar to you? Four G's, four F sharps, and E, E, D, E, E, D. Yes, it is the same as the first line. So we have G, third finger, right? F sharps, Two E's and a D. E, E, D. I think we can go on. Here's our E again. Right there it is on that just one above open D. If this is our D right here, then E is just one higher than that. Boop. Let's write that in blue. E, 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 E. We're going up, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, and we're going up one more. Three fingers on the D string is G. One, two, three, four. And we've got one, two, three, four beats, and one, two, three, four beats of silence. Okay, whew, it's getting complicated. Let's say, let's start on the third line just for practice. Ready? And now say G, 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 G. F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp. E, E, D, E, E, D. First finger plays E, 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 E. F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, F sharp, G, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Okay, we're almost there. We are almost there. Let's do this last line. I'm seeing an E, four E's, four F sharps, and one G, rest. D, pizzicato, so you have to pluck that one. Oops, it erased my D. And one more, pizzicato, and it is a G. Okay, let's say that last line together. Here we go. One, two, three, Four. E, 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 F sharp, F sharp, 
F sharp, F sharp, G, rest, D, rest, G, rest, rest, rest. Now notice that these are both G's, right? But they're not the same G, are they? This one is open G right here, and this one is three on D G. So there's two different G's. Okay, this song is full of different things. So you're gonna have to work your way through slowly. But let's listen to the music and hear how it fits together. And here we go. One, two, three, four, G. Okay, that is pretty fast. So you are gonna have to really practice the little parts all by themselves, but this is gonna be a really fun song for us to play. Have fun, see you next time.